It's like I tried, but not really, you know, like, ugh, I wanted to look good, but I really just didn't care to be in your presence that long, so you get a little bit, you don't get the full glam, you get the, mm, it's alright, kind of thing, you know, that glow, boom. What's up party people, it's Adriana, and today we're going to be doing my no makeup, makeup look. It's kind of like, I like the dewy glow look, you know, um, right now I'm actually doing a snow day. I have, I have a snow day in school, so it's like the perfect one, like, just to like, go out, go get food with your friends, you know, you want to look cute in the snow, but not really, and you don't want to look dusty at the same time. It's kind of like one of those little things. So, I hope you all enjoy this video, like and subscribe and share this with people who are also out here in the cold but still want to look just as dewy, just as glowy, you know, we're not in our winter shade, we got that winter shade going, but you know, it's okay, we still cute and we still glow. So keep watching and see how I do. This. Okay, so first I do eyebrows. Well, mm, I lied. Hello, oh, well, JK. Um, I do primer. You know, because even though it's a no makeup makeup day, you want to look flawless, you know, flawless. Alright, so I'm going in with my Makeup Forever Step 1 and mostly focus it where I have a lot of pores and texture, it's so like on my chin. Then we have primer. I like to let that like soak in before I just like go directly in with foundation. So I'm going to do my eyebrows and honestly I don't really do too much. You know we're not going for that instant brow situation. We're just trying to look like we have eyebrows. I don't really have eyebrows so you know this is pretty handy but I don't do too much. You know I just like flicker them up a little bit. And then I just fill in wherever there's not a lot of hair. So mostly like the end part, but I don't like go in for that like block. Like I just kind of like just shade it a little bit, you know. And we don't want too much product in the front of the brows because, yeah, really I just fill it in just like that. It's, it's not too much. You know, we're not putting concealer around them, you know, we're just like, I have eyebrows. That's all I need, you know. And like most people, I have two different shaped eyebrows, so I just kind of make them look like they're related. You know, they could be cousins, they could be distant cousins, you know, like twice removed type of cousin. They could be twin sisters some days, some days, you know what, they're not from the same family at all. So, um, yeah, we're just going to fill it in, follow your brow shape. You know, people who already have those thick eyebrows, y'all just go ahead and just skip this step because you don't really need to do all that. I'm going to do another primer. So after eyebrows, I'm going to do a, another primer, which is the e.l.f. Mineral Face Primer. It's like the golden one because we want that glow from within, you know, even when we're not wearing makeup. So I just put a little bit and it's very yellow, so, you know, you just got to like rub that in a little bit on all like the high points. And that just adds a little bit of glow, you know. Yes, it probably looks like glitter on your face, but once you put on foundation, it doesn't look like a bunch of glitter all over your face. Especially if you only use a little bit. A little bit goes a long way. Now also, this is how we get the glow. Um, I like to use Le Bronze Highlighter, the Jackie Anna Artist Couture. And I just take a little bit out of the lid. A little tiny tiny bit like a little bit and I like to paste that right here you see that see that glow just a little bit not too much you know because it's kind of like a bronzy color so you know it just kind of looks like that that natural glow you know it's like all right, so now that we have all of our glow base on, 
Um, I'm going to go in with a not a, a like a full full coverage foundation. It's more of a medium to full. And I'm going in with, with the BH Cosmetics Studio Pro Total Coverage Concealer. Right? Now this is a concealer. And it's my shade. So I'm going to use it. Um, just a little bit. You know, just a little something something. And I'm only going to focus it in the center of my face or wherever I need to like spot conceal. I'm not going to do like a full mask of foundation. Just a little bit. You know, just a... You know, we're out here trying to catfish people. We're not, you know. So I like to put it here. And I like to sheer it out with my sponge. I don't like to do too much. Now you can see that I'm only focusing it on like the center of my face right here. This is where I usually have my dark spots. So that's where I, I like to add coverage. Okay. Alright, so now I'm going to go in with like just a touch. Just a little bit of the concealer version. Well, the under eye concealer version of this. Just literally like this much. Very, very small amount. So as you can see, like I'm just bringing it like right here. I'm not like bringing it all the way up. I'm just like right here in the center of my face to give it some kind of light. It does not do like cover up all of my under eye, dark circles, none of that. It's just a little bit of light to the face. I'm going to go in with a little bit of powder. Just a tad bit to like not crease the under eye but honestly when it's like a no makeup day I'm honestly okay with a little bit of creasing under the eye if that makes sense that's it that's the only place I'm putting powder like I know for oily people you're like oh snap like how she's not setting her surface I'm going for the dewy look I don't want to look powdery or anything like that the blush that I feel best for my skin type or tone or whatever you want to call it um, is like a peachy blush I try not go for like a pinky blush because I don't feel like I'm really that pink in the face so I use my black radiance one I mean not black radiance BH cosmetics then and I like to use this peachy blush right here. It's like pinky peachy. It's not too much. It's not overpowering. It's just, you know. Alright, so now that we are going to finish the base, like this is it. This is all we got. I'm just going to spray Fix Plus to melt it all into the skin. I'm going to take my contour palette again and just go in and define my crease a little bit on my eyes. Make sure there's like no fix plus because then the pigment will be crazy. So I'm going with my contour shade right here and go in and define my crease boom that's it just a little bit of something something and then on my crease why can I speak then on the lids I'll take my highlighter in ginger snap black radiance like my go-to highlighter and I take my finger and I'll just place it right on the lid Give that glow. And kind of like rub the shadows together, honestly. And I'm also going to take more of that highlighter and put it on my cheekbones a little bit. 
This one is more golden than rose gold. So I'm okay with like kind of packing it on, you know? But yeah, see that glow? It's just like a little mm. your skin but better situation. And then I'm gonna take my sponge situation thingy thingy and just kind of put everything together. Mm. It's like glowing, but it's not that. Oh my gosh, she's wearing highlighter. It's too much. Like, it's a nice, neutral, like, my skin but better base. And that's what's important. Now, I also like to... Look at this. Somebody come get this. My Fenty... Shimmer stick. And it's very sheer, so like... I can just put it literally anywhere and blend it in with my fingers. And even like right here. Even on the forehead. And I just blend it in with my finger. If you notice, there's a lot of blending going on. Just a lot. And it gives you that eww, eww type of look you know so that's it for like the base and then going back to my eyes I tease some mascara this one's by Maybelline it's the colossal volume I like volume mascara so just apply a little bit of that All right so now that we just put our mascara on um, I like to do a few different lip options and I'm gonna give a few to you as well. So you can go ahead and do the whole Vaseline, just a little something, boom, you're done. Um, also I really like these, um, Barely Brown Sheer Maybelline Lippies, like lipstick situation. It's like brown, but it gives you that shimmer. No lip liner. It's just like a shimmery brown lip. What y'all think about this one? It's very moisturizing. It will transfer like it's a lipstick, but it's just like a sheer brown color. So that is Barely Brown 240 by Maybelline. So it wouldn't be a look without me doing a lip liner. Like I'm obsessed with lip liners. We've talked about this. Um, so I'm going to use Nutmeg from my ex. And do uh, this little line. You know, a little something something. And I am going to bring it in. This is a true brown right here. And if you want, you can go in with like a pinky mauve color. And this one is by Motives. It's an all day look of lipstick in the shade Discreet. Now just put that in the center. So this will give you like that pinky, my lip, but not really situation. You know, I prefer to stick with a lipstick and not a lip, like a liquid, like a, what am I saying? I prefer to be with a lipstick than a matte lip, you know, like a, something that's a satin finish, you know, but not, not a matte. And of course, of course, I love gloss. So this gloss is from the MAC and Star Trek collab, I guess, thing, and it is the Pleasure Planet. My favorite lip gloss and it has these gold flags and I'm just here for it so I'm gonna just wear I'm just gonna wear this lip gloss alone so I'm gonna wipe 
this lip off in. Alright, so now I'm going to go in with the lip gloss. Look at that. Oh my god. Mm. You can also go in with the Fenty one. I just couldn't find mine. It's somewhere, but I just can't find it right now. So, yeah. This one is still like my favorite all the time. Neck lip gloss right here. Look at this. Mm. Mm. And just the glow. Now, if you do want to be fancy, you can put on eyelashes, but like. That's just like most of the time when I'm doing no makeup makeup day, it's like I'm in a rush. Or it's not that big of a deal if I'm not wearing makeup. So, you know. But, yes, this is my no makeup makeup day. I hope you all enjoyed the video. And go check out my other videos. I will have them somewhere on the screen, either here or here. I'm not sure yet. And, subscribe the button is like right there or right here or right here is you're grown you know how to do youtube just do it um and share this video of course boom boom like me with with glasses am hmm? i giving you light yes